You're watching EVH Gear TV. Official Van Halen merchandise for EVH Gear TV is provided by VanHalenStore.com. Now, here's your host from Ontario, Canada, EVH Gear artist, Eric Broadbent. Hey everyone, happy Friday. Eric here from EVH Gear TV. It's showtime tonight. Not showtime right now, but it's showtime tonight. Uh, Quentin James is first over in the chat. It's always awesome. Pretty cool, buddy. Um, so I'm really excited. Tonight's showtime. Uh, George Pohon Jr. is returning as a guest on the show tonight. And I could not be more excited for the fans and friends of the show uh, giving away a Wolfgang guitar tonight. I am stoked about it. You can see it back there, right back on the bench, just wait on the couch, just waiting for someone to take it home tonight. I, I'm as, I am as excited myself tonight as if I was receiving the guitar. I love that guitar. I, I did not necessarily play it, but I held it in my hands for a brief moment one night and uh, it was phenomenal. So someone tonight's gonna be very, very happy. It's only three hours away. We're just minutes away from 6 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time here in Ontario. Three hours from now, we'll be kicking off the show. George Pohon Jr. will be uh, checking in with me. I'll be touching base with George about 8.30 my time, just going through a production run through and make sure everything's good. Uh, and I'll be having him back uh, at 9 o'clock. We're going to go through the program at a certain point in the evening. We're going to do the uh, spinning of the wheel. I've got that all set up. There's going to be the giveaway for the guitar, and then there's going to be uh, several subsequent runner-up prizes as well, too. Uh, I'm like I say, I'm just as excited for you guys, whoever wins this guitar, as if I was going to win it myself. Um, and I and I know there's going to be multiple disappointed people because it's going to be only one big winner tonight. But I promise you this: just hang in there, shake off the dis disappointment after you're, you know if you're one of the ones who did not win. There's going to be lots more contests coming up. I already have stuff right here in the studio, ready to go for the next contest. So trust me, I'm going to keep rewarding you guys for watching. It's going to be very very brief because I still have to shave and all that good stuff and look uh, get all the uh, the look for the show <laughs> ready for tonight. I still got to barbecue a couple uh, uh, pieces of steak to get ready for my uh, pre-show meal and then I've got to get everything situated so it's going to be a real quick one but I like to share this exciting stuff with you and I'm doing another unboxing uh, you can see behind me just a little bit kind of tucked away there let's move the microphone a little bit you can see the EVH stool came in today that I was talking about so I built that thing pretty quick so I got the EVH bar stool liking that it's going to be really nice for some of my demos where I don't have to sit in the chair and uh, just about an hour ago not even a full hour ago my, the, my road shipment came in it was looking like it. Uh, um, it uh, it was looking like it wasn't going to come today. It was scheduled for today, and it was running late. There's some customs issues and things like that. We're all good. Going to jump to the chat. This is going to be bam, bam, boom, 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 like that. I just update. I just uploaded a video from the road as well too, and it was fun doing one in the Camaro today. So Quentin James is here. My beautiful poison ivy is second. Quentin James says, "What did I win? You won the first seat in the front row." Uh, Sinner is joining us. Hey, Sinner. How you doing, buddy? Spence, uh, hey, Eric, just watched a video from yesterday. Notice my name wasn't on the wheel. Can you make sure that it's fixed? Yes, it's definitely there now. Um, I sent an email today uh, to make sure that you're there. And do me a favor, Spencer. Go to uh, facebook.com slash um, that's, that's where the, I have a graphic. Take a look at that graphic and make sure it's there, okay? Um, I, I'm like 100% sure that it's there now. If you can, Spencer, do that while, we're, uh, while the show is being broadcasted here. Go to Facebook, have a look at that graphic, and make sure that it's there, okay? Um, and just come back and tell me that you saw your name there. Um, Lyle Ketchum says, hey, everyone. Mark Taylor, hello all. Cutter Savage, what's up, everyone? Gary Davlin. Uh, my beautiful poison ivy saying, "Hey everyone, Cutter Savage, happy Friday! Can't wait for the wheel spin. I'm excited too. I'm I'm on the edge of my seat today. I've been a bundle of nerves. Didn't really want to sleep last night because I'm excited for you guys. Truly, truly am. Um, nothing about myself is is all about you guys tonight. Uh, let me see. Um, can you give us some hints on the runner-up prizes? I can't because I want I want everyone to tune in tonight. It's gonna be, they're, they're small. They're very they're small. They're not stickers things like that. They're cool. Okay, they're a little bit better than stickers. Um, they're cool. It's it's something that between myself and uh, another third party who I'll tell you tonight um, was able to come through and um, really really uh, w was helpful for this. So it'll be something just to ease the pain of not winning the guitar. Uh, let me see here. <laughs> Cinder says, "Good day for guitar d nerds." Indeed, I agree with that one. Um, let me see here. Uh, oh, by the way, Eric, I think we all agree. Wear the Eddie pants tonight. It's a nice occasion. You're talking about the striped ones or, uh, my shorts. I'm not going to do that. I, you don't, you don't, you don't want to see what's below this desk. Um, JD Gonzalez says, hi. And, oh, Sinner says, received my Acacia guitar today. Fantastic. Um, po post some pictures and tag me in it, Sinner. I haven't been on Facebook much today other than just to post a quick link just a moment ago. I saw a lot of notifications, so maybe you did tag me. 
Okay, Spence says, will do. Uh, Adam EVH says, hey, everyone, Poison Ivy. Adam EVH, hi, Poison. Cutter Savage, hey, Adam. And uh, so everyone's discussing. Uh, they're saying hi to one another. We're going to jump into this unboxing. Here we go. All right, so I had a box come in um, from Rode last week. Rode has been really, really good to the program, um, really helping my audio level go, you know, this is sky high. I love it. The video I did today in the car in the Camaro was using the Rode uh, Filmmaker kit. I can show you the couple of pieces here. I have the, the wireless lavalier kit. All right, so that's the transmitter. All right, um, and then obviously here is a receiver, which I had plugged into my Tascam unit, which is a recorder. So that was really, really nice. Even though I'm like just two feet away from the recorder in the car, I was able to plug it in and a phenomenal sound. There's a couple things they were going to send in the last box, but it just got mixed up in shipment. So it's here now. So we're going to jump into that right now. Uh, I just saw, I think I saw who, uh, Gary Davlin. I'm not sure if I said hi to him. And uh, Doc Tar is jumping in. Hey, a happy Friday, Eric in room. And okay, good. Spence Oz says, just check fe Facebook. It's there. Thanks, Eric. So everyone is on that wheel. The wheel is ready to go. My iPad is charged 100%. I'm charged 100%, as you can tell. It's going to be a good night. It's going to be a phenomenal night. My biggest show to date and a year and a half of doing EVH uh, gear TV slash the old discussion slash Eric's videos. It's the biggest one to date. And uh, and I'm glad to have someone like George Pahone on the show to celebrate with me as well, too. This is all for you guys tonight. All right, so a quick unboxing real fast. Let's get into this one. It's a nice tall one here. Let's have a look. You can see I'm actually digging into the box before I even told you I'm digging into the box. All right. So here we go. This is a tall one. Lots of bubble wrap. I'm saving every bit of bubble wrap now because I'm starting to ship a lot of stuff out to you guys. Okay, this is cool. All right, we have a transporter too. We have the Rode uh, Boom Pole Pro. 100% carbon fiber boom, pro boom pole. What is it with my syllables and things lately? All right, let's see if we can get into this real quick. I'm not sure if there's a real way to get into it. Um, I don't necessarily want to cut this. Oh, here we go. All right, there we go. I think it unscrews. Man, I tell you, Rode is the bomb when it comes to quality packaging. Check this out. And this is all carbon fiber. Pardon the bangs. It's light. This doesn't feel any heavier than maybe a guitar pedal. I, I, seriously, it looks like it's it's solid as all heck. But this apparently will extend to uh, three meters, nine feet. And I'm assuming it, I've never used one yet. So yeah, just twist and lock. Holy cow. Twist. So that one, I think. Um, okay, so that one already is unopened. And then I open up the one at the top, I think. It's going to take a little bit. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Holy cow. You can't even see that, but I'm going to try to chip it sideways. Look at the length of this thing. That's like nine feet long for a boom pole. And I swear swear to God, it's no no heavier than uh, um, like a, the weight of a guitar pedal. Maybe not even that heavy. So that's that's the road boom pole. Boom pole. Okay, I won't put it back in the uh, tube yet, but that's nice. comes in a little carry tube to save it from getting all damaged. All right, try to carefully put that down. Another big box. All right, good. No addresses on the bottom. Try not to cut myself. And the way I'm cutting right now, I could have seriously hurted something down below there. All right, what we got in here? Okay, this is cool. I'm gonna I'm gonna go I'm gonna go in reverse order from. So this here is the PGR2 uh, shock mounted uh, microphone pistol grip. So that'll mount on top of that boom pole that you just saw, and I can run my uh, NTG3 mic, which I have. I don't have it. I can't show you right now, but I'll show you the box. If I can reach it. That guy there will mount on top of that. Okay. So if I'm going to use that in the house and I don't want to use anything else, that'll mount right on the top. And it's got the uh, shock mount and everything on there as well. So that's going to be super, super nice. And a pistol grip is always cool. We got, um, all right, here we go. This is awesome. The Road Reporter mic. So last year, the, the biggest uh, video I have on the channel right now is my interview um, at the UVH gear booth at NAMM. And in that, in that video, you saw me using this microphone here. Now, I've taken off the, the stickers off of here because it was my old show's logo on here. And I'm changing the, I've am changing i changed the name of the show. Um, so, obviously, I'm getting new decals in here. So, this mic is going to be replaced. I can't be representing Rode by using a, comp a competitor's product. So, this one's going to be retired. And now, I'm going to be using the Rode Reporter. What I love about that is a much longer mic. And that is pretty much uh, realistic, real size. So, I'll take a look at that. 
it gives me a lot more room to hold on to the mic to reach a little further over to a guest. I don't have to be basically spooning the person, you know, to basically get the microphone to them. And the cool thing with that as well, too, is Rode's uh, new shooter wireless kit that you saw there. We'll plug into the bottom of it right there. And now we have a fully 100% wireless microphone, a news gathering microphone that has a range of uh, 100 meters. So a good 300 feet. So it's going to be phenomenal. Watch for this at NAM 2018 in January. I'll have the EVH Gear TV logo wrapped around that as well. Phenomenal. Love this. Thank you, Rode. Okay, dig a little further into the box. Lots more packaging. And I have a lot of cleaning to do here before the show tonight. I have to really hurry to get into this show on the road for tonight okay we've got a few other things here as well too we have some oh these are the um, uh, special cables to go with the uh, the pistol grip and I've got some XLR to uh, to 3.5 millimeter jacks on my task cam unit I was referring to those recording in the car you, if you watch the Camaro video I did I just uploaded it about 10 minutes ago you'll see very very briefly at my console just to the right of me my little armrest there's a little box sitting there and that's a task cam field recorder and it takes either XLR inputs or 3.5 millimeter. And uh, there's only one 3.5 millimeter jack on there and there's two XLR. So I, what I'd prefer to do is use XLR. So the guys at Road uh, were very kind to send me a few 3.5 millimeter to XLR jack. So very, very nice. Thank you, Team Road. I appreciate that. And here's the big piece here as well. Let's take a peek at this. And this is the final piece. This is the Road Blimp. So if you've watched any 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 kind of behind the scenes things with uh, movies, when you're seeing someone with a boom pole on a microphone on the end of it, this is pretty much what you see. That NTG3 microphone, that shotgun microphone I showed you just a moment ago. This will unscrew, uh, this will unscrew, and the microphone slides inside. And I'm not going to open it right now, but it comes with that gigantic, you know when you see the big fur? It's like a, it looks like a, uh, they call it a dead cat. In this case, it's a dead wombat. Big fake fur. Um, attachment that goes over the outside of this so this normally will stop all the outside wind noise and things like that but the fur that goes over top of it will further the further the fur catches the wind and it's absolutely silent I've seen some really really good demos on this um, there's a, a fellow I just subscribed to the other day Marcellus I forget his last name um, I ha I'll try to post a link to his video. very very cool uh, he did a good review so I've got a bunch of reviews coming up I'm doing on road some of the scripts are already written this is going to be fun to do this one here for sure because the night and day difference you hear between using this outside with this and without this, it's like being in a wind tunnel and it's like me speaking to you right now. So there we go. All right, so I'm going to jump back and that's it. That's everything from Rode. Thank you very, very much, Rode. Um, talking back and forth with them last night, it's, it's funny because my, my people that I deal with are in Australia and the time zone is crazy. As you know, when I've had uh, guests on from Australia before, uh, um, Josh, Josh Gallagher, uh, who's actually now in North America right at this very moment. Uh, so I, I usually communicate with him about 10 p.m. my time, which is around 2 o'clock or something like that in the afternoon the next day. Lots of communication back and forth, and it seems like there's a really good rapport that we have right now. So I'm very, very thankful, and I want to do everything in my power to return the favor to Rode for, uh, for supporting this channel. I'm going to jump back over to the chat, say hi to everybody. We're going to get the heck out of here. We're going to tidy up, let you guys have some fun, take care of dinners for your kids and all that kind of stuff, and come back at 9 o'clock, and we're going to give away guitar and some cool stuff tonight. What did I miss? Uh, let me see here. Okay, it looks like everything's going crazy. All right, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Uh, okay, so the last thing I saw was Spence talking about the run-up prizes. Uh, uh, Sinner saying good day for the guitar nerds. Uh, let me see. J.D. Gonzalez, hi. Um, Spence will do... Let me scroll down a little bit more here. Um, Dactar, happy Friday, Eric and Room. Yep, I read that. Uh, so Cinder says, I posted a few pics on Instagram. Okay, I'll take a peek at that as well too. Um, let me see here. Spence Oz says, Dr. try a Blue Yeti. I have a Blue Yeti here as well too. And the boy and I both had a Blue Yeti. And we went from Blue Yeti to some Audio Technica and now gravitated to Rode. And I'm staying here with Rode. Um, I do have a Blue Yeti off to the side that I, I've just saved for, you know, if there's every once in a while if I do a remote interview with somebody. But I was telling the boy today about the, uh, this is the Rode NT1 that I'm speaking in. And uh, the Rode also makes a very nice USB version of the NT1, NT1 USB. So that's one I want to get down the road that I can use to replace the Blue Yeti completely. Just sell the Blue Yeti and, um, and be done with it. Um, let me see here. 
Um, is there a road better than an SM57? Uh, good question. Um, they, uh, you have to take a look on the website. I don't think they have necessarily shot. Well, they have shotgun mics, but like that style. Uh, but just depends on what you're looking for. Um, just reach out to their pre-sales team, like contact them, and say what you want to use uh, the the microphone for. And in, in what case, if it's mic and a guitar amp, um, I'm I'm using the same version back here, NT1 in my 412, and it has phenomenal sound. It's a condenser microphone, so you will need phantom power. Uh, let me see here. Um, uh, Cutter Savage, according to Google's calculations, with 17 entries, we all have a 5.55556. Uh, percent chance of winning is it 17 people I didn't count I, uh, I didn't count on there um, but let's take a look at the wheel if that sounds about right uh, let me see <laughs> JD Gonzalez is a bat uh, Cutter Savage for real Spence Quentin James I have a better chance of winning since Eric cashed my check haha <laughs> that's a good one I did not receive any payments that's for sure uh, let me see here um, Quentin James the boom pole looks nice sitting next to my new Wolfgang there you go well I hope I hope you win and I hope everyone else <laughs> wins I hope someone wins that really uh I, I just it's gonna be fun let me see here uh Quentin James says if I win I'll spoon with Eric okay you're automatically disqualified um spooning leads to forking all right that we'll leave that there we got to remember the young kids that watch the show uh doc, right now you have road on the show um uh, let me see here. Going dirt biking with my kids. Catch you all later. Good. Have fun, Adam. Uh, let me see here. Yeah, be careful for sure. Zachary Suter, hello all. Mystic Star. Uh, Cutter Savage, Zeppelin Mike. It looks like a Zeppelin Mike, doesn't it? Dead Wombat TV. Uh, let me see here. I saw a new channel. New name. Yeah, new channel name. Yes. Uh, Spence, I'll change the channel name. Um, if you're referring to mine, EVH Gear TV. Um, lots of reasons to change it from the old. And um, it's a new chapter. And it's a very, very good chapter. Uh, let me see here. Uh, Spencer says, according to my Fitbit, I have seven thousand seven hundred seventy-seven steps. I can't move, so I have to, I I have good luck. Stay where you where you're put. If you have to wear adult diapers or something, do that to save your sp your space. Don't move. Don't jinx yourself. Joseph Burt, hi all. A cool gear, Eric. Zachary Sutter, good luck to everyone in the contest. JD Gonzalez, great Eric Center. Good luck everyone to the guitar. Uh, almost tried for the guitar center says however I thought someone else could use it more very very cool of you center uh, I'm sorry that you didn't participate but it's very cool of you and admirable as well um, and uh, there, um, Zachary says there is 17 but I think you added one it might have been one that I forgot but it definitely was one that was in the list I read them all off last night from the Excel sheet and you know what tell you what I'm gonna read it again right now and whoever is listening very closely count on your fingers right now here they are again okay um, let me see here. Uh, here we go. So count. Steve Kennett, Blake Burris, Ichu Tenkari, Joseph Burt, Les Bellin, Dan Wilhite, Zachary Suter, Cameron Brown, Chris Armstrong, Carlos Santin, Matt Leverty, Tom Scardinia, Gustavo Gonzalez, Dan Hall, David Rodriguez, Howie Kittleson, Fernando Taveras, Gabe Granado, Will Dunham, Cutter Savage, Marcello Viscardi, Quentin James, Bruce Bryant, and Spencer Ellison. What's the number on that, guys? Because I have it just in a text document off to the side here, and I don't have numbers beside it. And if I count with my vision, they'll be wrong. So what was my number on that? I'll just wait because I know there's about a 30 to 45 second delay. So what do we got there? What's the number on that? It looks like a lot more than 17 to me, but I don't know. And the verdict is... Chase Ombre, how you doing, buddy? Uh, let me see here. Michael Smith, yeah. Oh, he's having his first beer. Get ready for the show tonight. It's going to be a big one. Michael Smith, same here. Center, I was on the fence. Honestly thought uh, someone who really can't afford one should be either way. Good luck, everyone. 24. That's what the number was. 24. There you go. Yep. And just verify that. 24. Do me a favor, guys. Um, trust me. I can use all the extra support I could tonight because I want this to be a fail-safe for you guys. So Spencer went a moment ago, went, went back and looked at the graphic on... Um, on the EVH Gear TV Facebook page. He saw all the names on the wheel. Can one of you guys, all of you guys, whoever, go back to the Facebook page again and verify that there's 24 names on that wheel? If you wouldn't mind doing that for me, uh, a couple of people can do it, one person. Just let me know, and that's where I'll let you guys go. Um, trust me, Poison Ivy here and I, we've been looking at this um, seriously over and over and over again. I don't want any problems. I want it to go very, very smooth, and I want it to be perfect for you. Uh, let's, uh, let me see here. <laughs> Mystic Star says, I'm praying so hard that guitar is like a shiny new diamond to me. Trust me, I'm all nerves tonight like because I know there's only going to be one winner and I'm going to be happy and sad at the same time because I know there's going to be a lot of people that are not as happy. 
Um, but we're trying our best to accommodate a lot of you. And uh, if you don't win today, it just means you have another chance another day. And there's going to be lots of them, and I, I guarantee you that. So I know someone's gone to look. We're just going to wait for that answer. I'm going to let you go. We're at 612 here Eastern Daily Time. And uh, I'm going to get cracking here, get a quick bite to eat, get rid of this um, mess on my face. And uh, that doesn't mean the mustache, by the way. Um, and I'm going to get ready for the show. It's a big one. Still got to do some production tests with George Pahone prior to the event. You can see when I say there's a lot of stuff that goes into a show before the show, hitting the button to go live and, you know, switching scenes and things like that. That's the easy part. Um, uh, <laughs> uh let me see here. The losses. Thank you. I'm ripping my rack apart just to install a patch panel. I needed something good to listen to. Wish me luck and good luck to the winner. I do wish you very good luck with that. Um, okay, just counted 24 and 24. So we're good. We're good on the wheel, 24, and good with what I said verbally. Rock and roll. We are ready to go tonight. I think that means Houston, we are good for launch. Uh, and I'm not going to tell you what time we're doing the launch because... I don't want everyone to just go and take off like the, you know, when you turn when you turn on the light and, and cockroaches run away. I don't want that. I want everyone to stay and hang with me, hang with us tonight and have some fun. I'm not going to make you wait to the end of the show. Uh, I'm not going to say it's going to be in the first five minutes. It's going to be tucked away somewhere nice and neat in the show. And I would imagine we're probably going to allocate, I'm going to say probably minimum 15 minutes on the actual giveaway. Maybe, who knows how long it'll go. It might go, might go as long as a half an hour. So I'm leaving. Um, I'm leaving some room in the uh, in the schedule tonight for for this for sure. It's a big, big, huge part of the show tonight. Um, but now I'm down to 23. Chase Ombre says I counted 24 as well, but now I'm down to 23. Uh, 24, brother Michael Smith says. And okay, so you know what though, uh, Cutter Savage says okay, new probability of winning four percent. But I was posting this. I think I said this somewhere today. Uh, I said it. I think in the email. I think I said. I send an email to everyone once again and just remind everyone, make sure you're subscribed, all that good stuff. And that's to everyone that's a contestant. And I said, think of it this way. Look at these big ones like the Guitar Centers and people like that put on. Your chance of winning in one of those contests is one in hundreds, if not one of thousands. So tonight, your chance of winning a guitar is one in 24. Your chance of winning something else now, uh, so if, uh, there's going to be, um, okay, I'm telling you, I'm going to say exactly what you're going to get. I have one more prize I'm putting in. Okay. Actually, no, you what? Know what? I might have a couple. So there's four things coming from one company. Uh, it's not EVH gear or anything like that. It's not EVH gear related, but it's very, very cool. And it's something that's related to something that's happened recently on the show. Not from Road. It's from another company. There's going to be four individual prizes from uh, this company. And I will tell you at showtime tonight. And there's going to be one or two from me. So there's four, potentially uh, six extra after the wheel. I spin the wheel, whoever wins the guitar, their name disappears. I spin it and I'm going to have a list ready to go. I'm going to say guitar. I'll write down the winner. I'll have the next prize package or prize I'll spin. I'll write it down until we're basically done those few and then um, we're done. That's how it's going to work. Let's have a quick look at the last. Um, JD Gonzalez says, I bring the beers for tonight. Daniel Hall says, he's feeling rough, but now waiting for results more painful than I thought, but I'm here. Thank you, Poison Ivy. I guess Poison was possibly asking how he's doing and, and wishing you the best. And uh, I know what Daniel is going through today. I just didn't want to share it here as well, too, because it's it's um, it's personal information, and I didn't want to divulge that. It's not my place to do that. Insomniac Matt says, 4% of someone who plays Monster Hunter. I like those odds. Very, very good. Uh, and Spencer says, are they guitar related? Like, can you plug them into an amp or guitar? No, it's nothing. It's guitar related. Yes. Um, it's, it's guitar, um, gear, uh, brand related, nothing that you're going to physically use, but it's going to be something that you can promote. Um, you know, that kind of thing. We'll say that, uh, it's cool. Trust me. It's very, very cool. And a couple, uh, a couple of the things I'm giving away, there's, they can be used with a guitar, not a pedal or anything like that. Uh, they might be able to be used on a guitar. No guessing. I don't want to tell you. It's just uh, come in, come and watch the show tonight. It's going to be a big one. I'm stoked. You can probably tell. I usually talk at about uh, 45 words per minute. Now I'm talking at a, or, you know 450 words per minute. I'm talking at 750 words per minute because I'm excited for you guys tonight. Uh, all right. Uh, so uh, we're going to get out of here. All right. 616. Six, 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 I got a barbecue. I got a shave. I'm going to be back here at 8.30 getting a test with George. Be back at 9 o'clock sharp-ish. Try to make it as sharp as 9 o'clock as possible. Friday night, EVH Care TV. You do not want to be anywhere else. If you've got guitar buddies that uh, are out there and you think they want to see a really cool show, we're going to be talking about some great new music from Cairo Knife Fight. Incredible, incredible group. Um, 
looking forward to it. It's going to be awesome. You want to be back here. Get here a few minutes before um, 9 o'clock to be like Quentin James. Try to beat Quentin James in the chat. I dare you. I dare you to try to beat Quentin James here or Poison Ivy. They're here before I'm here. All right. See you guys all real soon. All right. And you know what? Tell us, little man, what are you playing? And what's your name? See you at 9. Cheers. My name is Eric, and I'm playing Floating Guitar. Video production services provided by Design 39 Media. Visit design39media.com for all your website, photography, and video production needs.